Welcome back to Living Local. Talented shock artists will transform the sidewalks of Schwebert Riverfront Park into a spectacular optical illusion this weekend. The 7th Annual Chalk Art Festival brings together hundreds of local and regional artists sharing their creativity and talents with the community. And here to tell us all about this unique event is Kevin Maynard, Executive Director with Quad City Arts. Kevin, how are you, man? Doing well. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. I always love having you here. So <laughs> let's, let's talk about Chalk Art Festival and what people can expect when they go. Yeah, I mean, the great thing about it is that, I mean, it's, it's free to attend uh, and love so when that. people arrive they can just kind of wander around check out we uh, check out a bunch of artists creating really great chalk art yeah there's food vendors uh, Bent River that will be there in the afternoon for beer and there's live music all day long wow and so how many artists are involved in this usually so this year we have over 130 artists that are participating wow. so about 30 in the youth category and the rest are in the uh, the I guess the, the adult category yeah, that's and problem. so with that I mean there are 90 different people pieces of chalk art that'll be created yeah. and so some of them are artist teams that work together. And so. you mentioned you were you mentioned food and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. You have food music. It's kind of a a multi uh, as you know, there's there's lots of aspects to this yeah. festival. It's not just the chalk art. Right? Yeah, yeah. So I mean, it's an opportunity for people to come out and really spend the entire day, uh, which cool. is really great. So there's also some kids activities like face painting, and mm -hmm. there's a bounce house. Um, so families can come out and just you know in, enjoy a good day on the river. Yeah, and so uh, let, let's talk about the how, when did this start? How long has this been going on? So this is our seventh, seventh right? year. Seventh yeah. Year? So okay. it started originally, uh, and it was spent a couple years in Davenport, a couple years in Bettendorf, and then okay. we've done a couple years in Rock Island. And I think we found our home at, at, at Schwieber Park. I mean, <laughs> park, it's, a, yeah. it's a great big area. It's got the river right there, yeah. and so it really just creates a really like great atmosphere. Yeah, and it's, so it's at Schwieber Park. What are the hours for this event? So on uh, Saturday, <laughs> they will be from 10 to 7, okay. uh, and then on Sunday, it is from 10 to 5. Uh, and so it will be there until 5, but we announce the, the awards and the sure. winners at 4 o'clock. And there's no cost? No cost. I love that. Yeah. So how do you keep that no cost uh, situation going? Uh, we have some wonderful <laughs> sponsors and underwriters okay. for this event, including yeah. the City of Rock Island, Nestle Purina, um, Bright Bat Designs, okay. uh, and all sorts of really great uh, organizations that help, help support this and bring this together. Yeah, and l let's talk about some of the... the uh the upcoming events too, real quick, because you have some other things coming up this month, yes, right? Yes. Yes. So uh, obviously we've got Chalk Art Fest happening mm -hmm. this weekend. Um, next month we have uh, an artist coming in town, Sadia Faruqi, who is an, an, a children's author, cool. um, who will be spending some time in the community as well as uh, at the Artsy Bookworm doing a, a book signing, and that'll be in the about the middle of July. Oh, that's awesome. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. So let's talk about um, a little bit. Where can people find the details? Is it the best to go to your website, yes. Facebook, um, etc.? You know. QuadCityArts.com is always a really great uh, space to check that out. Okay. Um, but our Facebook page is also up to date, um, and we'll be posting on our Facebook page throughout the weekend, so you can kind of follow along and see yeah. some really great things happening. I should mention that uh, we do have a community art piece for people who aren't ready to take on a full <laughs> eight by eight foot square. Sure. They can come out and be part of a uh, be part of creating a, a, a community chalk art piece, which oh, means they get a one cool. foot by one foot square, and by the end of it, it'll be all different kinds of uh, I'd say. Um, Levels of talent of artists creating one cohesive image, yeah. and this year's theme is uh, Alice in Wonderland. So. Now, do you see the designs ahead of time? Do you kind of know what people are going to do, or is there no. a surprise to you? No, it's always a surprise that's to us. So cool. So yeah, so we, I mean, that's that's sort of the best part about being there the entire weekend is yeah. getting to see how it all comes together, but also how different artists have different techniques uh, yeah. to make those their visions come alive. And you mentioned awards. Yes. And and how does that work, and who votes on that? So we have a People's Choice Award, um, so you can come out, anybody who comes to Chalk Art Fest can get a slip to choose their favorite artist, their favorite design, oh, um, and right. vote on that, and so that's our People's Choice. And then we have five <laughs> judges who um, will spend Sunday walking around, looking at pieces, wow. and uh, making the decision on who who wins in the in the other categories as wow, well. That's awesome. And how long have you been at Quad City Arts now? Uh, this is my fifth year. Wow. Yeah. Congrats, man. Thank you. Thank that's you. That's so cool. It seems crazy. Yeah. That, <laughs> so, that's yeah. And, and you're such an asset to the community. I, and it's, I appreciate it, that. You know, we're very lucky to have you. And like, uh, talk to us a little bit about how, you know what do you love most about this particular event? Oh my gosh, uh, it's really hard to say. I think it's just <laughs> that it's two days. Uh, in the sun uh, and just really like <laughs> I think it's just like it's, it's seeing the community come together and watching the, yeah. the chalk art just like really take shape and really honestly being impressed about the talent that's in our community uh, yeah. when it when it comes to the arts um, that is so awesome. it's just it's a good family-friendly event I love it. Well, thanks yeah. for being here, man. To Happy to be Shock here. Art Fest. Good yeah. luck this weekend. Thank Have you. fun, man. Wear your sunscreen, of course. Yes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> for more information on the Chalk Art Fest, you can go to quadcityarts.com. 
We'll have all those details posted at OurQuadCities.com. More Living Local continues after the break. Stay with us.